Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Arno Blur, and today, today I want to teach you how to flip. Is this the sign for flipping? I don't know. I want to teach you how to flip an image in Photoshop. Okay, let's roll the intro. Alright, so a few months back, I was making this uh, thumbnail for my other YouTube channel and I was having a real hard time flipping the arrow in Photoshop. Eventually I figured it out and it is super easy and I, th I thought to myself, hey, if I had a problem doing this because I didn't know, then there is definitely somebody out there that also doesn't know. So I am here to teach you this. This is simple, okay? So. Uh, I need to put the recording on my computer, okay? Okay, recording is on. Oh, okay, so you start by opening up Photoshop. Uh, <laughs> that's crucial if, if you want to work in Photoshop. And this is what you do. You, you create the new layer, shift Control n if you're on a PC. If you're on a Mac, I, it, I think it's almost the same except the names of the... the uh, the buttons are a little bit different. I've just never opened a Mac, so I'm not 100% sure. But then you just drag your image that you want to use. Now we can use the arrow. We could use, we use forever alone here, okay? So you have your image and how are you gonna flip this one? You want it to face the other way, okay? Easy. You see up here where you have the width and the height, if you press here and do a minus see what happens it turns uh, if you want to flip it the other way the vertical way you do the go to the height here and you go minus and you flipped it all over easy right now let's say that why am i using forever alone now let's say that this has happened i put my arrow and I've already pressed enter and I'm on a new layer, okay? Now, I'm creating this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful art, piece of art here, as you can see. And I, I realized that I want my arrow to point the other way, but I've already pressed enter. What do I do now? If I click it, there is no width or height here. Guys, this is also easy. Now, this is what you do, you go to the, uh, you go to the layer that you're working on, let's say that we're going on the red arrow here, and you just press Ctrl T, if you're on a PC, that rhymed. So look, then you get again height and width here, and if we go to width here and we go minus, it flips, easy. And this is another tip, I didn't know this when I started using Photoshop, that if I've already made the size of the image, how do how did I how did I resize it? Easy, Control T. Then you're back on track, and you can go to the Forever Alone face. You can go to Control T. You can resize it as you want. Ah, oh, we we maybe want it to face. Uh, we don't want it to be upside down because that's crazy. So we just do minus here, and voila, we have it. Enter. That's it. Easy, right? So. There is nothing more to this today. This is just a super easy tutorial for those of you who are wondering how to flip an image in Photoshop. And hey, if you want to like, you can go here and then you can, could uh, do forever alone. You could go to duplicate layer. Yes. Then you have another face there and you can do move that to here. And then you can go control T, do a, Flip it like so, and you have a mirrored image. I'm alone here in my apartment. All right, that's about it for today. This is super simple. The, now you know how to flip an image and you know how to mirror an image. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments down below. I will promise you guys that I'll answer, or I'll do my very best to answer. Other than that, if you could smack that like button for me, you know that helps me out. And yeah, subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out. Peace.